Where's everybody? Hmm. This is uh, a little odd. Anyway, we'll carry on with this anyway. It seems to be working fine. How are we all? We are here, we are back. How is everybody? Ping pong, ping pong, ping. Uh, VC, VC, VC. Washed out, washed out, blah, 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 blah. Um, music in the background, let's play it quietly. Nice if I never know. Yeah, if you're gonna leave, I'ma let you go. There we go. How is that? That should be better. 
Music is loud and quiet. Is it still the same? <coughs> yeah, okay, so. Um, yeah, I'll probably need my headphones on a bit later. Um, still playing about with this set about Goya, but it seems to be okay. Um, though I am still thinking about going back to the old system. But I don't know. We'll, we'll see how we get through it. So how are we all? Um, some giveaways in a bit. Uh, a Tetley Man. Um, yeah, giveaways. I said giveaways. Freebies. We, we have some uh, freebies this evening. So if you want one of them black and yellow things, um, stick around. So we've got three more bottles of um, flavouring, which uh, we got there. Gammy, I've still got yours, and it will go out at the same time as this freebies. And... Um, yeah, as well as that, Gammy, are you going to Expo? Would you like a ticket? Because, um, Gammy's, Gammy's uh, win should have gone out ages ago. Um, but I have got some Expo tickets to give away. Um, so everybody's, uh, what's the word for it? Everybody is eligible to go for one. They one day tickets. Um, so it'll be either the Saturday or the Sunday. Um, I don't think there's a restriction on how many you can win. So you might have to register them separately, but you can um, effectively, possibly, probably, maybe, um, win more than one ticket and go on the Saturday and the Sunday. I don't know how it works technically. I don't think you can register two codes on one account so you might have to have two accounts but anyway expo tickets to give away and I'll be giving away let me see because I'm, I still can't remember how many I've got to give away I think I have 10 so I might do two tonight two next show two the week after two the week after because there's uh, eight weeks till expo or less than eight weeks apparently um, yeah, so we need to get them tickets out to you. Ah, oh, you mean Anglesey? Ah, oh, okay. Well, you can always give it a miss, you know. Now I'm going to change over to Jamendo as my music because I don't like YouTube's adverts. And this might be really loud to start off with. Um, let's log in. Look into Tremendo music. Use my Facebook. Look at my favourites. Play my music. Behave. No, no, that's happening. Let's just click on radios. Um, pick some music. What should I do this evening? Um, should I go for some jazz? Go for some happy music? Country? Pop rock? I'm, I'm in a jazz kind of mood. Um, let's go for some jazz and uh, see how loud it blurts out now. So, fingers on the ears. Um, oh, I don't know what's up in there. That's mega quiet. So, I don't know what, it seems to be uh, there in the background though, so that's fine. Oh, that's a pain in the backside. Yeah. So what you got to make the use of the last weekend? Packing up and stuff and lots, you know, unless you get done before then. Just need the bare minimum in the van, just for it. Quick Sunday after the after the event, you know, like a, you could get away with that possibly, but it's a long it's a long trip, I suppose. Anyway, we could hire to uh, to Grumpy, Tetley Man, Gammy, uh, Dave Fisher as well. I see you there. I could see you there. So, how are we? Um, hopefully, I'm a little bit clearer 
uh, to light that I was the other day. Um, loving this new camera, it seems to be really clear. Oh, I do look a little bit washed out. Um, let's see what I can do about that. Because I've got some filters on applied, and the color correction is a bit. Mm. There we are, that's a bit better. Um, I've got a bit more, bit of colour there now. Um, hey, J. Jolly, good to see you too. So, yeah, um, freebies. Um, yeah, it did look like uh, a sheet there, didn't I? Um, but yeah, Baba's up in uh, bed. She's been puking all evening, uh, which is great. And. Yeah, this is the time for me to relax and chill out and, yeah, you know what I mean. That music seems to be coming through quite loudly on my mic, rather than the desktop audio. Is it still quite loud? Um, anyway, a couple of beers I've got here that have been nicely chilled, um, so I have this, this is the Hop Foundry. Hop Foundry uh, orange infused pale ale. And I also have this uh, innocent gun. Uh, man goes on the run. Man, man goes on the run. Man goes. Yeah, very cheesy. So, uh, as a mango IPA, we'll see what they are like. Um, in a bit. I'm not sure what Chris is doing, whether he's awake or watching or he's probably um, just lurking. Anyway, first time in Yogs, what is everybody on? I'm on an empty tank at the moment, so I need some juice. Um, I did buy a lot of juice yesterday. I bought um, a lot of um, juice that Imi was getting rid of. Imran at uh, Vape Nation Cardiff was getting rid of some of the um, the, 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 the kind of dodgy label juice I, I, you know, it's this stuff, you know but I saw it there and I thought a strawberry banana I love some of that, a strawberry banana ice cream and he was knocking them out for £2 a bottle because he, he's decided he doesn't want anything to do with them anymore uh, through a bit of persuasion from the, uh, the local TAs, but um, yeah, you are on the small. I did see that uh, the small uh, RPM 40 um, RPM. Surprisingly, from smock isn't for doesn't stand for a really pathetic mod. Apparently, it's quite a good one, um, which is nice to which is nice to see. Um, yeah, so I've got to look for my... I've just refilled it, haven't I? Um, my Purple Tears. Um, I do hate it when I run out. I've got to refill the bottle. There's no less than 100ml left in the bottle. I could get sloshing around when I fill this one up. Um, and yeah, I, I picked these up last... Uh, a couple from fast tech they eventually arrived so this is this is the gear clone and to be honest it's a it's a it's a good job um it was like 10 10 pound or well, 10 10 dollars nine dollars something so that's about 750 you know, seven fifty eight pound and the clone I did buy three clones, two rainbow of different makes, you know, because they, they do multiples, and I bought a, a black one, I think, because I got gold and didn't fancy the steel, I can't remember which one it was. Anyway, bought ten replacement bubble glasses, because I didn't, I know I'm going to smash them, and they're only, they're only little. Uh, I thought I'd get a lot of bubble glasses ready for the inevitable, and I'm, just, I'm surprised that the quality of the threads. Now, I've got the original here, 
There's my original. The threads can be a, a real pain in the backside to um, to get on. Because, um, let me unscrew this now. And I don't mean to get on as in tightly fit in. I mean to get on as in, um, hang on a sec, what's happening here? I'll deal with that later. But the, the top part, okay, so I'm unscrewing the top part, it's taken the bubble block. It's really, um, the threads are really crunchy. And I gotta say, they're crunchy than the FP threads now. Um, well, the clone, it, it, they are smooth as babies, but they're really, really nice, you know, butter on chocolate kind of smooth. I'm the only show I can't, maybe because I'm running at 1080 60 frames. You know, if you, you know, you, was that a dog snoring or what? Um, maybe that's where it is. Because I think I'm pouring out it. Um, check your settings everybody, can you, can, am I coming through to you at 60 frames a second? I should be. Um, because I haven't changed my settings. Um. Oh, I am. I am. You, you do need it for the, the, the quality to get me through, you know, because I am. I am quality. I'm, I'm working good. And it's, uh, you on watch page stream health, blah, 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 blah. Um. Stream health. No, not of stream. That's blah, 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 blah. Hmm. I don't know why I clicked that. I am looking good. I do need to get some decent light in. Um, fine on the phone and computer. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Don't go there. I, I've I've lost so many things. Like, you know, I just said I bought three of these to review. Well, there's the box for one of them. There's the, the plastic. Now it, it actually came with. Let me show you now. It actually came with a glass fitted and a plastic bubble glass. Now, it's a nice idea, but I'm not into plastic. Don't really like it. That's why I went to the other ones. And it came with the the same style drip tips as the original. And I really, really dislike... Um, okay, then. I hate those drip tips. They are horrible in the mouth. Really don't go well with me. Anyway, anyway, I hate plastic glass, yeah, plastic glass, it's, um, what's a oxymoron, it's plastic or it's glass, make your bloody mind up, come on. So I'm not sure where they've gone, whether they've been pushed off my desk somewhere, because I can't see them. Are you there? No. This is why I need my uh, torch to try and find out where the hell they are. there. They probably, oh, do want an SOS beacon. They're probably in this big pile of stuff on my side. Because um, they're not up on the top. Anywhere. 
okay don't get my ocd in it, it doesn't matter i can't be ocd'd on this because i have one of them here and i know that the other ones can't be too far because they haven't left the house unless the baby is probably in the bin in which case oh they could be in the bin i don't think so i'll convince myself that they're not in the bin and they're in this pile and i'm not gonna look for it okay And, as well as that grumpy, you do need clouds at 60 frames a second. 30 frames, clouds are just don't cut it these days. But yeah, it's, um, it's good. It's, it, all the insides were spot on. Um, it's a really good one-to-one -one clone, but threads are better. Um, the only worst thing is if you look at the top, the machining of the gear isn't the machine of the gear isn't that good. Um, but everything else about it, it's it's really good. Really, uh, the O-rings are nice, uh, nice and tight. Yeah, so let's see where we are. So we do have a 1080p stream, three watch, four watch it on 1080p, so that's good. Um, so it is, it is coming through fine, good. So let's have a look and see what people are on. We've got Grumpy or Vapor on the RPM 40. Um, Jajari's on the Pico 25 Goblin Mini. I like some old stuff. I, I've got bought a lot in the auction, so I can't wait for that to uh, come over. Right, if you see me blinking a lot, there's a reason. Um, back last weekend, me, being in an idiot, left the, the bulbs on in the kitchen. And one of the bulbs was down, I went up and replaced it, left the power on, just thinking, oh, it's just a quick change. And I stared into the bulb. Now, I've got diabetes. Uh, which meant, which means that I, I light you know, look it up, light is not good for people with diabetes. And I stared at the light, and I have got this constant um, black spot, or blind spot now, where I can't see properly, and that's why I'm moving my eyes to look back and forth at things. And it's, it is right in the middle. Um, Sometimes you get it, like welders get it, um, if they, they spark up uh, off its... But, yeah, um, I'm kind of worried, because I don't know if it's going to be cut, because this, this has been like three days now, and I've had this um, patch there for three days. Normally it would go in a day, you know, it's there, and it's gone, but it's stayed, so I'm... I'm kind of concerned for my sight. Now I've had laser surgery on my right eye, but my left eye I'm still waiting. I just run up today and confirm the appointment to go there. So maybe they'll spot something. Maybe there's um, something that can be done, done during the surgery. I don't know. But yeah, I'm kind of worried because it is my stronger eye as well. Uh, when I close my eye. It's the you know it's the it's the eye I, I depend on. Um, if I'm out and about in the sun, and it's too bright, this eye shuts automatically, really quickly. Um, it doesn't like light at, at all. Um, so yeah, migraines I could I could handle, but this the idea of not being able to see is kind of. I'm kind of shitting bricks about it, you know, it's, it's not, um, not good, but I just have to wait, see what, whether it'll go, and it's not like a, it's not like a sparkles, it's nothing like that, it's, it's just this thing that's just not shifting, so I don't know what to do about it really, I can't do a lot until the, um, the surgery. Uh, 
yeah, yeah, I, I make also look worse. Um, no, well, you know, these are mere mortals, like, you know, they've got to be put in their place, like, um, Jay Johnny's on tobacco. Um, well, it seems nice and mild. Um, if anybody was on tobacco and, and gets a bit bored of it, get some banana flavour in. Just drop in some, some banana in tobacco, changes it in a fantastic way. There's no other flavours. You can't put blackberry or blueberry or cherry into the fat tobacco like like banana. Banana is is like a game changer with tobacco. Now I can't look into the camera for too long directly because it's got a light on it, hasn't it? So I have to find some blue tack somewhere to cover that up. Um, but not today. I'll just look at the text and I'll look at myself on the screen, so um, even that, you know, it's it's kind of double vision here. Not good, anyway. Let's get some liquid refreshment. And it's, you know, it's not as if I've been doing anything too bad to make it worse the last couple of days. Um, okay, I, I forgot to say, I've got a new mic. Um, did I did I say about this last week? Did I tell you about my new mic and my new mixers? I don't know if I did. Um, yeah, so new USB mixer at the ready. Here it is. This is um, just a little play around mixer. Now this is cool, and I gotta say, if you want to do um, any recording or just a little bit. These are about 20, 26 dollars, but if you want to order from the UK, these are about 30 pounds. Um, and it's got a lot of features. Um, you got your two XLR stroke quarter inch jacks here. Um, you've actually got a step up to a phantom power if you want to do phantom power. You've got your EQs, you've got your gain, your high, low, no mid, and You've got some basic effects, so you've got um, delay and repeat on there. Across the bottom, you've got uh, yeah, your, your main volumes and uh, peak LEDs to go with your gain. You've got uh, input left and right, uh, line in and out. You've got your main yeah, oh, over here. You've got your main out headphone for monitor and a monitor jack. But this is this part's the best bit is you've got um, USB so you can play music through the USB straight through. You can play uh, music here. You can actually record as well because there's a button in the back which says, "Do you want me to be just a, a dumb simple um, mixer, or do you want me to be a sound card as well?" So you press a button and it, when you plug it into your PC. It becomes a sound card, so that's all your inputs and your outputs. Um, that means you, you can't have your channels in isolation, but it does give you the flexibility to um, you know, play around with the, the line inputs and stuff. But the other good thing as well is if you can take this, you can you can power it with a power brick. So um, have I got one nearby? So, let me take this back right here. So you can plug this into that. So this fires that up. Now you've got a line in, you've got all the inputs. You can plug a USB into there. Plug in a mic or a guitar into your inputs. And record to your USB. So you could take this set up with a mic and whatever. If you had a long train journey or you wanted to do some recording of some sounds or music somewhere, um, you could take this with you. This is like a mobile recording studio. 
just add a mic. And the mic that I, I'll suggest is the um, is it the MP800, which you can buy with an arm for about 18 quid from Amazon. Uh, or you can buy on eBay for about £12 on its own, £13. Comes with a shock mount as well, XLR. So for under 50 quid, you've got a really good, handy little um, podcast setup. Now, when I bought mine originally, I bought the um, the Behringer uh, Podcast Studio, and that cost me uh, way more than 50 quid. <coughs> um, so yeah, if anybody needs to get them to mix it. Um, now, I did buy two of these mixing desks. They look very similar, but one stated at Bluetooth, the other one didn't. But it showed Bluetooth on its settings. Now... So, this is the one that I've got that I would advise people get. Okay, so if you notice the blue going across, and yeah you can notice that now this is the other one now this one is rubbish because there's so many issues with the sound I connected the PC try and record on audacity and it adds all interference and, and all sorts of stuff but when I bought it it didn't come in the, the padding and yeah, I got the black version. You can see the difference. These have got white. It's still in the box. You can see the white um, tops on the things, and it's grey across the middle. Yeah. So avoid the the one with the blue dots and the grey. It does have a uh, micro USB in the front as or not. It's a trans flash. So this this is what it is. I went for this because. It had a trans flash on it, so you could just put a, a small uh, memory card in there to record, and you have your backing track played and recording onto the, the card. But with the issues that I've got with it connecting to the PC and it not recording properly, um, I've asked for it to be returned basically because um, it's not worth the hassle. And this one is just as good to be honest it does anything that I've needed so that is all well and good and yeah a couple of things I'm gonna be changing around as well this week um, I've just bought a new PC um, and I'm going to be swapping it over it's I'm not sure whether you saw it last week I don't think you did but um, Yeah, I think the stream is fine. So I got a new PC. Uh, basically, I'm replacing the uh, the the 8350K with 32 gig of RAM with the 7700K, which um, I'm gonna put it is faster the uh, <laughs> despite being a, an older generation what one just the one generation before um, it is faster and I'm, I'm happy to see the difference so I'll be swapping these two over it's also got a stack of drives in that I put and it's got a blu-ray uh, reader right there so because it's faster I'm going to be running as my main machine and this one will be relegated to um, Sutton's room probably actually. Um, so yeah, it's, um, I did buy it with, um, I had a GTX uh, GeForce 1080e, but it doesn't have the outputs I need for this so um, I'll probably end up selling it and maybe going for a better card make a bit of money back off it 
and then getting them a better card when the prices come down a little bit for the the 2060 super or 2070 super um, so yeah if I can get a little bit of money for that because it's a it's a it's a, you know, a good card the spec of the 1080 is a, a cracking card uh, just that it's got one HDMI it's got a weird DVI s slot which I've never seen before without the extra pins and it's got a couple of uh, display ports which I can't be bothered with um, especially when my current setup has got HDMI and a DVI stroke VGA I don't want to faff around with loads of adapters and stuff so anyway how you so good to see you um, it's only been rattling away for nearly 40 minutes um, doesn't time fly and I still don't know whether uh, the holster it is about in the house we'll find out now hello holster are you there is there anybody out there because he's not showing up on my uh, on my screen either on uh, VC come on wake up old man I see what he's on messenger he needs a kick yeah I can see it uh, Sue well, I can see you um, no one. let's have a look on Facebook do -do 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 -do. I can tell you. The, or is that, I mean, is that the holster tub? I've got a vivid imagination, but I can't imagine that.
in somewhere. In his hot tub. Anyway, let me give him a prod, shall I? So yeah, I think uh, I need a bit of a Another rewick on this thing, it's a little bit. Mm. I put some flavour in one of these tanks and it's just not shifting. Um, I think it was the Red Envy. Um, yeah, this stuff, this Red Envy, it's, it's a nice flavour, but it's not quite as bad as Heisenberg and, and uh, Red Estate. Um, but it's one of those that does kind of hang in there, you know. Um, even though, like, I use it on this one, and this is the crown with a buildable deck, so, you know, I put it in there, and I took it apart, give it a good clean out, give it a coil a good scrub, and it's still hanging in there. Is it, is it me, or is it, you know, annoying? It, it's, it's not a... The coil is not a complicated coil, so there's not many, you know, there's not many places that the flavour could hang in. You know, if you've got like complex coils or even just Clapton's or whatever, the um, what's the word? The juice can get in the little nooks and crannies and and, and gunk in and settle. But. Um, this is just simple, a simple coiling here, a simple single wire uh, coil. So it shouldn't need a, a massive scrub. But you know, I think the next time I take it apart, I'm gonna have to give it a good one. Because as well as that apple pie, I am tasting that twist of something that shouldn't be there. Mm. CD taste. Like uh, in a dodgy bar. Now in the background, I'm, I'm kind of doing some stuff for some websites I'm, uh, I've been working on for somebody, and yeah, it's a bit of a pain, um, because we've got servers, and the server says it's this, um, but yeah, it doesn't want to um, click, you know when you've got the back end of stuff and it just doesn't want to work together? That's why I'm kind of getting here.
Chris, I'm not sure where he is. Come on, Chris, wake up. He was chatting earlier, but he doesn't seem to be uh, chatting now. stuff on this thing. Um, hopefully they'll fix it for me, because to be honest, the uh, customer service is pretty good. So, G. Jarry is looking for a 22mm RTA for single coil and dual coil. Now I've been using the old Goblin and Mini again. Um, hmm. 22mm RTA. I'm just trying to think what the Kaylin Mini was. I think that might be 24. Or, or more than 22 anyway. Kaylin Mini, what is that? You can always go for a Serpent. You know, go for a Geek Vape, uh, Serpent R RTA. I'm pretty sure that's 22 mil, uh, the original ones. Good old school stuff. Um, I've got my RTA there. This is the this is RDTA. This is. Hey, there's a thought for you, Jay Jerry. What, what about getting a, uh, a serpent mini RT, RDTA? You can get them for cheapest chips these days as well. I mean, I found mine in a, a local shop, and they were they were a five each. There's a funky custard. Is 
Lucy, come on. He starts to come on. He hasn't forgotten what day it is, has he? Tub, or is he just in the tub, I wonder? I don't have a roller miser. That's a, that's a th th thought there. Yeah, yeah, it'll, um, obviously you've got, you know, the ease of changing the cotton in, in these is a little bit easier than the, the original Serpent Minis. Huh. I don't know where I woke him up. You know, he said he was in a jacuzzi, but I think he's probably just, uh, you know, let him on rip. I bet he's watching the, the politics. I gotta say, I've been watching that all evening. Um, anyway, I can't wait any longer. I've got to end one of these. Um, do I go for the the orange infused pale ale, or do I go for the man goes on the run? Which do you reckon? If it's an orange, put orange in the room. If you want mango, put mango in the room. Which one should I get into? Let's see what gets the most votes. Orange or mango? Yes, I know it's kind of immaterial because I'll end up drinking both anyway, but... Mm. Mango, mango, mango. That's the only problem with the RDTAs is you've got, to, you've got to give it a bit of air space as well sometimes otherwise you know you get you get every now and then you get where you go in tip it up do I follow politics yes I do um, my bias is labor I'm, a, I'm I previously voted Labour, voted Independent, because um, you know you get areas like most of Wales is Labour, Scotland is Scot SNP or whatever, and England is a mixture of all sorts, you know, because that's the way it is. Um, and that's interesting because you know, obviously Scotland wanted independence and they want to rule themselves and stay in Europe. I would say build a big wall and let them stay in Europe and Wales. Um, that's a that's a big wall for Wales, mate, wasn't it? So, um, you know, Wales have, have pretty much got things set anyway. So that's not. I don't think that's a, a big issue. I don't think Wales and independence and having their own parliament is as necessary as Scotland because. Scotland seem to be screaming out, thinking that they can do so much better being independent from the rest of the, the UK. Um, I say, yeah, give them a, give them a chance. Hmm. No, these wicks in here, um, they are not too long actually. It's a small, it's a small glass. And they only come down halfway through the glass, so 
Um, maybe I overpacked it a bit on the the wick, uh, which is now you know it's it's sat for a little while. Maybe it just needs a re-wick. Like most things, I was thinking the other day. You know, after you've you've whipped something and you've left it for, a, you know, if you use if you whip something, you use it for a day or two. You get the compulsion that you want to um, re-wick it because you're not getting the flavour you was the first day. You know, you get your first your first tang or two is breaking, yeah, and then it's good for a, a day or so. Following day, towards the end of the day, you're thinking I. I'm not getting the flavour quite as I want it to. And it's a case of reworking. Um I was thinking, well, reworking all the or every time it's using a lot of cotton. It can be expensive. But and then again, a pack of cotton, even if you go for like um well, pick a cotton, any cotton. Cotton bacon. See so you go buy a pack of cotton bacon. At, 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 a, at, a, at, a, at a retail price is like five quid, and it's only a small pack, but there's a hell of a lot of cotton in that pack for five quid. That's the same price as one single stop coil. So you could re, you know you could rework every single day, and it would still be stupidly, um, you know, stupidly cheaper than stock coils. Yeah, yeah, I think that's uh, just a bit tight. Mm. Do you know what? If Scotland went... Uh, I have my opinions on politics. Uh, I don't claim to know everything. In fact, I've got a layman's view on it. But my thoughts are, if Scotland wanted to um, oh Muji you can get from Muji um, Muji Europe and they only uh, you could buy five big bags of Muji for 20 quid d including postage if you go to the Muji.eu site make sure you get the right ones though because they're two different types um, um, because, you know, you look at, on Amazon, you're looking at eight to nine quid for one pack of Muji. You know, you can get five for the price of two. Um, I did. I, I voted to leave. And I'm still a bit annoyed that my vote now seems to count for nothing because the politi politicians don't want us to leave. Even though I think, you know, they should go. I know. It's stupid. It is stupid. Anyway, go back to Scotland. Scotland. If we said, if they said, okay, fine, you want to stay in Europe, you stay in Europe. So, here's the scenario. The UK comes out of Europe. Scotland is so desperate to go back into Europe, they'll need to put up a border. I think. And Scotland will need to be paying the bills back to Europe because this is what this whole big argument is about. This 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 um this breakup. Um, the EU want money off off the UK as a well as a what's the word for it? I I think it's like um I mean. Oh, it, it is horrible. It's it's like it's like a rans it's like ransomware, isn't it? You know, they want this ransom to let us go. Now, Scotland are gonna have to. You buy thirty pounds for a three pound a pack. Really? Um, no, it's go go to the um, go to the EU um, go to the EU website and it, it'll be on there. Um, Well, the free postage, you know, d does it? Let me let me find it a sec. Um, uh, 
is that one? Muji.eu. <coughs> Muji.eu. Um, click on online shop. Um, Muji products. And £120. Organic cotton. So here we are. And they've got 60 by 50. 180 pads, there we are. No. Oh. So let me get the link. They are currently £2.95 for a big ass bag. Um so I'll put this in chat. J Jerry, you need to jump on there on this. Now the reason I buy uh five packs at a time simply because yeah, that's the ones I just posted, uh, Grumpy. Uh, it, it spreads the delivery charge out. You know, I think it's it's a couple of quid for delivery, so if you're buying one pack, you might as well buy a couple and have it last forever, you know. Uh, if you can afford 20 quid or, or so. Um, or even three packs. What's the price of three packs? So three packs, that's going to be nine quid and delivery is um, yeah. delivery is three quid so you can buy you can buy three packs of muji for under 12 pounds so that's seven and seven no, that's that. 3 8 to 24. So you can buy 640 pads for 12 quid. It is, uh, it is a bargain. Or you can buy two packs for a tenner. It's still way cheaper than you've been uh, paying, J. Jerry. Um, you're welcome. And these are the unbleached cotton pads. Yeah, the unbleached organic cotton, which is what you need. Saying that, I've been using uh, COTN cotton for quite a while now. Um, they were a sponsor a while back. I sent a couple of packs out, and I've kind of, I've kind of gone off the laces now because I'm not finding I get the same flavour from the laces as I do from the uh, unlaced stuff. So, yeah, I've kind of gone off that a little bit. But, yeah, the packs are, uh, are good stuff. They are... It's, uh, that is the same ones, J. Jarry. That is... They are the pads that you are looking for. Um... I think I put my boxes at the shed, but that is the ones that you need. Um, are they in the shed or are they in the car? They're in the shed. They are five centimeters by six centimeters. Uh, the first thing you do when you get a pack of these is open the pack up and give it a little shake so they can expand. Uh, they do expand, they do get fluffy. Um, it is a good idea to separate some out into little bags if you've got bags because they can turn into one big concertina. It is very good, it's, it's not just very good, it's awesome. Um, uh, it's, there's no pr promo code though. Um, Home delivery, click and collect. Oh, I didn't know that, but uh, no, that's home delivery is fine. Um, but the, yeah, bargain. Anyway, I've closed uh, my other window. Where's that gone? So yeah, so 
obviously the UK is currently pays the EU as kind of a membership. So where is Scotland going to find the money for this? There's only so much haggis you can make. Okay. Um, I'm, I am joking. That's a, that is a joke. No, but where, where is Scotland going to get the money for, for uh, the uh, subscription to the EU? I have no idea. Is it going to come like magically from nowhere? is awake. Well, when you are ready, um, jump on. I think I'm going to have to give this a little uh, clean uh, replacement because I'm not getting the flavour I, I want from it. So I'm going to go and give this a clean out and a rewick because it, it's at that time where it needs. Uh, we reckon I think need your own currency to go into the EU hmm and this is where things will be interesting because what has got going to do you missed the 3 a.m. fast tech streams I bet you're all richer now missed that one. Anyway, where was I? Mango. You said mango, so here we go with the mango. Um, it is not a very strong mango at all. It's just a really a really little hint of mango. No, they're expecting mango as in full on mango flavour. Just, it's just less than I thought it would be. Anyway, if Holster is ready, late night beer stream is worth on yet. Um, but now I think I'm gonna have to calm them down. My, uh, I'm starting to get to a point where my body needs a bit more rest than I'm, I've been given it. Um, to a point where I'm, I'm, I'm thinking about going on a diet. Now, I'm five foot six, stroke seven, and uh, 19 and a half stone I am now, so I've put a little bit of weight on. 19.4, actually. Uh, but something needs to happen, so I'm gonna have to go on a bit of a diet. Maybe cut out all the the sugary crap and actually acting like a diabetic. Is it too little, too late? I don't know. I'll already find out um, when I've had my surgery. So, yeah. Sent by a random fast at shit at 4 a.m. Yeah. It was uh, lots of stuff. Um, maybe I'll do one if there's no show on another day. Um, I'll have to look and see when there's not a show on, because I don't want to overrun on anything else. And um, Fruit is the thing, see, I don't mind fruit. Veggies are mm, potatoes. Um, but the thing is, that's the thing. You can't, when you, when you, if you're diabetic, Oh, I'm looking at diets. You can't win unless you're a rabbit. This is my thought with diets. You can't win unless you're a rabbit. Because, you know, you got sugars in fruit. So, mm, you got to watch what fruit you have and have small portions or whatever. And then, you've got vegetables. Now, I love sweet corn. I could eat sweet corn all day. 
Uh, no, can't. Okay, when you look at potatoes, mashed potato, day in, day out, I could do that easily. No, can't have that. Starch and carbs and all that sort of stuff. Okay. Uh, tomorrow night after so long, UKVS has ended. Mm, could do. Um, have a little trawl through Fast Tech. Could be lethal at the moment. Still need to pay for my Higgies uh, wins. Um, I know they go through all the orders and stuff. They, they normally get in touch with me in Messenger and say, Oh, you ready to sort this out? I'll go, Yeah, fine. Um, so, yeah. Thursday is Grim Day. Grim Day is uh, live. I, I wanted to um, go on and call in on Tuesday, Bro Tuesday, um, but I didn't because I wasn't sure whether it would do an international call because he, he reads where they're from. Um, Thursday is Grim Day. So, yeah, you can win. Can't have sugars. So, that leaves rabbit food. I can't do that. Saying that, I could eat chicken all day. Can't have bread because it's carbs. Um, again, I could eat burgers all day. But apparently, that's not good. Because when I have a burger, I'll have like a couple of burgers. Maybe, maybe more. So, yeah. Anyway, let me get a holster on so we can talk and be ready, holster, because I've shoved it uh, blah 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 a couple of times. And the music is good, music is nice and cheesy. Um, so I need a holster to come on so I can go and sort my tank up in two minutes. Things are going ping and pong. Frustrating. But what do I do? I tell you what I do. I call an holster and say, Where are you? You get. Lo and behold, let's see how long he stays on. I see that. Even an holster. I can't hear you. It's going to do another one of those, is it? Are you muted? Let me uh, turn up the music. Hello, hello. Hello. Can we, uh, can you talk? Oh, let's try and, let's try and reconnect because um, it's not behaving again so this happens with VC sometimes I'm going to because he is uh, he is there let's try again okay pop out and do all. Hello. I can't hear you. Can anybody else hear him? Because I can't. 
operation headset. No sound. Okay, so... Hello, hello, hello. You're not on the screen yet. It shouldn't... It should still work. You can see, uh... The sound. Hello, you are on the screen. That's very odd. Um... Hello? Hello? No? You are me. <laughs> okay, so this is the uh, Marcel Marceau. Uh, three words, first word. The. You can't hear me too. Can you hear me? Hello? You can hear me. Okay. So, um, you can hear me. I can't hear you. So why is that? Um, is it a song? Is it, is it, a, is it a song? Is it a play? Is it, um... No, the mixer is is all set up because uh, cause we had the music playing through fine as well, so um, I don't think it's the mixer. Also, I was in a I was in a VC chat the other day as well. So let's go to over there speakers USB mic USB. <coughs> My mic is fine. So why is Let's have a look at VC settings, shall we? VC, what are you doing to me? Um, settings. Audio and camera setup. Audio. Let's have a look at this one. Hello. Hello. Ding dong. Ding dong. The witch is dead. Now you are going to be mega loud now because um, you're on my mixing desk. How's things? Hello. How the devil are you? I'm good. Working. That's good to hear. So, ah, what are you drinking on? Main thing. What am I drinking on? Um, I am on um, a, a caramel macchiato with uh, Bailey's with a hint of orange truffle. No, I was in I was in Aldi's yesterday, and I've I've passed it a couple of times Aldi's and it was still there. But they, they do um, a Bailey's strawberries and cream summers. Yeah. Oh, have you tried that? I was fancying it, but I thought. That's ten quid a bottle, and normally Bailey's is only like six or seven quid. I'm too loud. Wow. Oh my gosh, that's never. Sorry. Happened. That's never happened in the uh, in the no. existence of this show. How about that now? Is that? Yeah, there we are. Okay. It probably says too quiet now. Um, What's that? Yeah, who tried it? I. Ha uh, I have. Just one moment. Now, I think it could be because the sub and the mix, sub and the main are in different channels, but yeah. Um, <coughs> still a little bit better. Yeah, because I think he's coming through the main as well as sub. Now, what I could do is swap us round, and I could play about, I could swap us round, I could put the sub up, so, there with me, set, Chris.
That one. Okay, so talk now. I'm talking. Yes. Oh, you've got it. Yeah. Okay, so that's the main. So, what do you think of it? I, 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 <laughs> I, I think it may, it would be better on ice if it had an umbrella with it. It would be better on ice. Right, let me try something now. Mm. I'm going to click on a button, and we're going to carry on talking. And if people can hear us, I want them to say yes. We can yeah. Okay, so you can still hear me, yeah? I can hear you, yes. Now I'm quiet. So, <clears throat> so that should be all be. No, we should all be on the same level. Well, I think we all know that Chunk isn't good with technology. <clears throat> well, 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 well. There, we're both going through the same thing, so it all yeah, should be yeah. fine. You're talking about diet. At least you've taken we, the first positive good? step. What's that? We're wearing black. Wearing black. I always wear black. No, it's okay. Yeah. Okay, so I know what I know. I mm. look it up. Uh, so what? Do, what do you think of that? The strawberry? Is it? Uh, is it very Moorish? It, it sounds like I could probably open it and think, oh, there we are. It's gone. Is it a milk, milk, milkshake? Uh, yes, it is. It's a bit. Yeah, it's. Uh, it's like a. It's like a melted strawberry ice cream. Uh, in fact, that's interesting. Just, uh, I think I've got the, whichever is it, red dead, dead red. Mm. Is that is that yeah. is that straight red dead? Which one is it? No, it will have a touch of uh, uh, element frost in it. <laughs> it is. I I, I still I can't can't get my head around that idea of having. Uh, a cream and a, and a frost. But but did you know I'm? It's actually uh, one and a half years today. One and a half years. Yes, seventy eight weeks today. Wow. Yeah. So, should we just get stuck into the numbers then? What None of that. As what, much as I remember. What have you? I, what have you spent this week? Uh, I haven't bought anything this week. Yes. There we are. This is a, a nice catch-up week. So, yeah, if I haven't bought anything for a couple of weeks, I I did get vet mail today. You did but, have the uh, Oh, did the, the tank come? Uh, yes, it did. Yeah. Well, let's have a look then. I uh, sorry, I haven't got. Uh, pull it, pull it out, and let's have a look. Oh, there we are. So he's going, there's a vape mill there. So Scotland, what are we going to do with it? Let's get rid of that Gemendo and I'm going to get rid of the Muji as well. Let's spread that over. So, a couple of things. So, my, my tank arrived, the, the little tank. Mm. But uh, because I think, uh, as I uh, mentioned to you, this week uh, I've mostly been eating. No, um, I've, I've been trying a new juice this week. Ooh. The Aisu Cactus. So, this is one of the ones that we had from... Um... Zap juices. Who um, give us some? Uh, give us some juices to test out on the show. Yeah, uh, we we did a couple of weeks and then um, I, we we know we're gonna start revisiting them. So Chris tried this and said, "Oh, we want to try this one." I haven't had time to, to put it in my tank yet, but mm. he mentioned something today, and I th I'm now thinking, "Oh, do I try that?" So no. what do you think of it? Now this is a, a an interesting thing that uh, I kind of like it. I've got it in the I've got it in the uh, the Zeus. 
I'm, I'm trying it in the, the Zeus, and it's, do you know, it's, I've never tried a, co a cactus. You know, uh, try to... <laughs> yeah, well. You never tried a cock, what? <laughs> well, what was it? I, uh, well, I, I remember when I first met you, somebody said you collect parrots. Well, they said you'd had a cockatoo. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> so what do you think of the cactus? Yeah. Well, it's got me thinking since I sent you the message that uh, whether I've put a, a Nick salt uh, with ice in it. Uh, I, I don't think so. The bottle I've thrown away, but it's... Uh, the cool ardor on it is uh, is pretty harsh. I'm starting to think that we might use a, a, a an icy shot. Yeah, but but it was one of those uh, nick shots that came with it from uh, Zap Juice as well. Oh, okay. Uh, so I don't think they were ice shots. I can't remember. And. Because I've never tasted a cactus flavour before, and uh, yeah, well, you know, it, it reminds me of the difference between a cactus and a Subaru showroom. Yeah. Yeah, the cactus has got the pricks on the outside. Yes. <laughs> yes, and uh, the. Uh, I, I've got to say, uh, I I do like the flavour, but uh, the the coolada is, uh, as I said to you, is strong in it. It's a bit too uh, bit too full on if you chain chain vaping. Certainly now it's uh, uh, the winter nights are starting to come in. Mm -hmm. so I think I think somebody's turned the heat off. Yeah, I think it was probably Craig. Hey, Craig. So Craig just wanted to chat. Yeah, we should saw Scotland off. Yeah. You know what we could do, don't know? Because you, you know this. This could be an ideal opportunity, right? <laughs> this could be an ideal opportunity because you know, you know, Trump wants to build the wall. Well, maybe he can practice with Scotland for us, and you know, you know, give us a test out. You know, build a nice big wall across there. Oh, you know, global warming. They say that the, the the levels are rising. Well, they just built, just dig a massive trench between England and Scotland, yeah, and put all the dirt on on the, on the land either side. When it fills with water, away you go. And well, now... I think that was it. You know, the the Romans they built a wall to keep Scotland down. Oh, and there we have VC. I love VC because it does this for me every time. And you're back in the room. There we are. Anyway, yes. That was my uh, political. Do you know I watched the House of Commons tonight, and the guy from the SNP, whoever he's called, mm -hmm. he was really good. What? Well, so, Expa his name. Expand on that. Well, the fact that he he wanted to like leave Europe or wanted to stay in Europe. Absolutely. So yeah, you get all the dirt from the massive trench. You know, you can make it a couple of you know make it a couple of miles wide. So you know, there's no chance do you know I, I did see that guy i remember i was thinking come on somebody needs to shout come on brave heart i was just waiting you may for... take my i was waiting you may take my country but you'll never take my eu what <laughs> yeah 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 so much for scottish independence we want to be independent oh but we want to be part of the eu but if so if uh if scotland becomes a sep independent country They'll make iron brew proper again. <laughs> yes. Yeah, they don't uh, see. They don't realise that, see. Because because that's the EU anyway. The hello. So, so going back to Isu cactus. 
Mm. What does it taste of? Taste of? Well, maybe it tastes of cactus. But as I've never eaten cactus, uh, what can you compare it they, to? Uh, does it have a cucumbery taste? Do you know what it is? Or it's. Uh, does it have a melon I, taste? No. Oh, Unicron. Yeah, Unicron. Unicron. I don't know where you've been uh, watching. Her scene is in you. Here you are, her scene. There's one for you. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, Scotland lost over 300 years ago. Uh, I don't know what. what you know, it's, it seems to be farcical that Scotland won their independence, but. I want to desperate to stay part. Did just to be what? start stay part of the EU. Yes. Anyway, uh, uh, let's talk of uh, Flexit or whatever it wants to be called. So, what does it taste of? I think you know, flowery is a right term. Flowery. Yeah, it's uh, it's not not an offensive taste. It's not bad. It doesn't take, it doesn't taste like offence. Uh, no, no, no. It doesn't taste of creosote. Mister. Ah, but it would. Hey. I wouldn't take offence at that. Yeah, so it's... Uh, I think I think for a, for a different taste, if you could dial back... Uh, whether it's I've put in a, a Nick Ice shot, I don't think so. Mm. Because I was reading the... Uh, reading the uh, ingredients, and it does say it's got... Cactus flavorings and menthol flavorings. Oh, okay. So, uh, what what kind of coolness does it have it, on a scale of one to ten? Comparing, if you, if you think of that super whatever you had as ten, frost would probably be like a five or six. Yeah, so I, I really like the, the element frost, but that doesn't uh, uh, freeze your brain. Uh, this is, uh, you know, WS23 Coolada. It is real, like, brain freeze is cold. It, is it colder than that, that super thing of a jig one you had? Yeah, it, it's like very super, similar to that effect. Super man, Manchi? Super Manchi, yeah, it's, uh, it's very similar to that. So, hmm, uh, makes me wonder yeah. whether they want to try it now. So, so. But I'm gonna have to try it. I have to try I've, it. I've uh, I've continued using it. And you break through that barrier. Uh, when yeah, when it when it feels like ice crystals are forming in the roof of my mouth, I either drink something hot or, uh, and I think that's why I've gone for a. A coffee tonight. So it's definitely not one for the winter mornings then. No, definitely not. <laughs> but then frost isn't either mine, so you know. No. Uh, okay, so my my tank arrived, and uh, I think on the interest the size. The, so which I, tank I, was that you ordered? I can't remember. It was the TFV sixteen. Oh. And so, so I haven't got it on a on a mod, but here's the Crown three. Okay, so that's um, a fairly big tank. Now that is, well, that's got that guard on it on there, like. Uh, yeah, let rubber. me take this off to give you a clue on the size. Yeah. Okay. Sticking rubber it makes it look bigger, especially when it's black. Okay, so the I've got the triple mesh coils in the TFV sixteen. Gee so. that is a massive tank. Yeah. Um, I guess you don't have to refill it that often. No, it's pretty good for that. And in here, I have uh, I have got the the Heisen Blizzard uh, that came from uh, Drip Hacks. Hmm. Yeah, you know, which is I'm going to say it's the neat. Uh, Heisen Blizzard, because I had it mixed with some Vampire Vapes with the last uh, uh, mix-up I had. Yeah, so I would just compare when it's on its own straight. Let me just have a check. Uh, new car. Well, I was saying I've got the, the triple 
uh, triple mesh coils in. So you've kept the the. the uh... No, I I thought I had, but it's gone by the wayside. Oh man, you need to keep hold of the original. We can uh, we can do a Steve Austin on it. We can rebuild it. We have the technology. So for a for a tank, it certainly knocks out. No. Sorry, it was four non blondes. Four non blondes. But I kept saying, "What's going on?" <laughs> Thank you very much, Babunch. I'm here all week. Uh. So I was I a compare. Say, I was a compare. I, what uh, four non blondes? Yeah, it was not bad. I, I've got to say, it's. Uh, it's nothing at all like uh, Vampire Vapes at uh, Heisenberg. No. But does, that, does it have its own character that you like? Yes, it does. Uh, it's not bad, actually. So how does it differ from the, uh, the Vampire Vapes? Is it fruitier or more mental? It's, uh, or... it's a lot fruitier. Yeah, less less on the aniseed uh, uh, notes. There we go, if we were going down that. It's, mm -hmm. uh, I don't know, I think, it, is it blueberry? I'm not sure what the mixed fruit mm -hmm. is in it. Uh, maybe blueberry and apple. But it's it's quite nice. Mm -hmm. And uh, so the, I'll go and get the, the one who knocks. Uh, so. The one who knocks. We, so so it's, uh, it's not bad is uh, this Heisen Blizzard. I, it's certainly one I could buy again. Oh, that's good. Yeah. And it's cheaper than uh, Vampire Vapes. Yeah. Always good. Yeah. It, I think I think it's like the difference between the Strongbow uh, Dark Fruits and the the Aldi Dark Fruity. Mm. It's very similar, but it's not quite the same. Yeah, but it's still nice anyway. But it's still nice. Yeah, still does the job. Uh, yeah, it's nice. Uh, I've not not too much ice. It's uh, it's got a a hint of cooling in it, but mm. it's uh, it's not silly like this. Uh, the uh, Isu cactus. Mm. So on to the the one who knocks. And sorry, I didn't bring the bottle so over. That's the other one. Yeah. Uh, in similar. fact, just one moment. I should have been more prepared. Mm. So this mango is, um, like I said, it's a bit, a bit low. It's a bit, bit lame. I think uh, expecting a more fruity flavour to it. It does smell quite mangly, but uh, it doesn't match in flavour. Yeah. The, the one who knocks. The Where's one who picture? knocks. Have I turned this the right way? Or did I turn the wrong way there? No, I turned the wrong way. Sorry. Is that, that looks like a, a spaceship or something. What is there? I think, it, isn't it a man in the, in the oh, mask yeah, or something? Oh, yeah, I can see, yeah. I, I, do you know why? I can, uh, I can see it now, you said. Yeah. Okay, so I've got this in the uh, in the top side with the, the, the old profile. That one is, well, somebody says, one who knocks is more like Vampire Vapes. It probably is, but it could do with a, maybe a, a touch more aniseed. Yeah. Is it kind of in between the two? Yes, I would say so. Again, it's quite nice, but, and here's my but. Here's the but. Again, I don't know if it's me, but... Uh, or it could have been the poker last night, but I had a bit of a headache today, oh. and I don't. And I was wondering whether I've. Uh, How many pints do you drink? Pardon? How many pints did you drink? Two. Two. So it wasn't a, that kind of headache. Well, no, no that, that was the first and the last. All oh, right, so two. Yeah, there might have been some in between. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. But uh, but uh, it was a long, long day at work today. 
and uh, the yeah I, again I I was wondering whether uh, yeah it's whether putting in the Nick salts because I did put Nick salt shots in this mm -hmm. and uh, and whether I was pretty sure I'm pretty careful uh, careful when adding in the uh, the nicotine but I hope I haven't added too much nicotine Okay, but it wouldn't be too. It wouldn't be too. Yeah, but uh, you'd be in on... addition, uh, I did go to the uh, the triple mesh tank today, mm. and whether that is, uh, uh, you know, I did read a review that said you know it does deliver a lot more nicotine to your body. Mm. Well, you 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 be. You be going through a heck of a lot more with our uh, triple coil. Yeah. Yeah, it, it could be. Uh, again, mm. uh, I'd probably use that more today than uh, than the, the profile. Because if you think it's, it's delivering, say for example, it's delivering three times as much, if you're using it the same amount of time as you normally would. So maybe if you don't use it as much, you know. Oops. But then again, you you used to the hand to mouth, didn't they? You know, you used to be there and having a vape and no. doing whatever. And yeah. So you, you didn't yeah. have the same. You didn't have the same problem with a single coil. No. So I'm but I've, I've changed the. I've changed again. It could be that uh, using the the cactus as well. That uh, but it's chilled my head too much. Yeah, it could be a cactus. Yeah, so yeah, pounds right there. You're getting three times as much, and then Nick didn't take. Well, the good thing is, it, it does generate a huge amount of cloud. No, it's a good thing when you're not going to set the set off the alarms. Yeah, but it hasn't set the alarm off yet. Oh, you say yet? It is. Uh, yeah, it, it's, it's bound to go off now, isn't it? Oh, mm. So yeah, I've had a I've had a, a good mix of flavors today. With the uh, it says, actually on the the one who knocks it says delectable fruits and aniseed. Oh. That makes and a, uh, such I a mixed massive it at difference. seventy thirty. Okay, so I'm gonna what I'm gonna do a minute. I'm gonna jump into. Um, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna jump into Nightbot. Um, so I've got um, got my tickets through for Expo. You uh, you able to come, Chris? I'm guessing it's gonna be a no. Is that it's a no for me? Yeah. Yeah, cause you, I think you said there was something on that weekend. Yeah, it's half term, isn't it? It's the it's the weekend before half term. Yeah, there's something around that. I can't remember what it is. Yeah, I think you said you. you yeah. Ooh, let's restart yeah. you again. So VC is playing up as usual. Oh, there we go again. As usual, cuts off. Um, Sorry, I'm just putting the condom on. <laughs> Still, have little Japanese ones. I I was going to say a joke then, and I, uh, and I I I pulled out of it. No, it's good. It's good to do that every now and then. Yeah. Um. I don't know why every time I, I go to Nightbot it says um, it says it, do 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 yeah 2904 it's, it's got all the messages anyway so um, yeah giveaway so uh, freebies Bees. last week um, I forgot to do this so this is um, the last of the chef's giveaways Chef's flavours, chef flavours. Um, we've got, I can't read the bottles because my eyes are gone. 
Um, I know the one is uh, ginger. So I think ginger. This one is uh, queen of puddings, and the other one is probably a custard and a shirt. And they'll go out this week to the lucky winner. So what I'm going to do is we're going to have a keyword. Um, so everybody is uh, everybody's allowed to enter. I think it's all set up. And we have a keyword. And we can't use that as a keyword. Um, uh, so the keyword for the competition is in the room, and it is anybody can answer. Um, if you're in jail, you're out of jail, so you can't enter. Anybody's in the room, and. This is for the Chef's Flavours, Chef's Vapours uh, one. So, a nice, easy one there for anybody who enter. There we go. Doing well, Pudpuffs, doing well, enjoying. Uh, will the giveaway be delayed too? Um, no, no, because these will be both going out. Um, well, I've got, I've got. Uh, By October thirty-one. What's that? It'll be yeah. going out before October thirty-first. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so yeah, get it into the room. Um, enter the uh, the code. So this is the keyword. The keyword. Is what keyword is Brexit? There we are. And yeah, there's a couple of people in the room. Just fire it in there. So we got J. Jarry, Pudpuffs, Grumpy Old Vapor, Mil, uh, Hersine, J. Jarry, Tetley Man, Gammy, you can all enter. And Holster. No, you need to put Brexit in there. You, you do need to put Brexit. Um, that's pretty. So at the moment, there are no, no Brexit. No, you've got to put Brexit in there. Brexit is the key word, not no Brexit. Just these Scottish people to be funny about things, you know. Yeah, I want you to. I want Grumpy to win just so you can send it to the Philippines. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, you want to buy some bath water. So the prize is some flavourings for your DIY. If you do DIY, there is 90 ml of flavouring from Chef's Vapor and a Chef's shirt. So let's see, we've got three eligible so far. So you need to get it in. Currently, it is Grumpy, Holster, J. Jarry. Tetley man. Hersine, you're entering. Or do you do do you do DIY Hersine? Yeah, Hersine. Craig, if you're doing DIY, it'd be good to enter. You just gotta do that little admission of Brexit. It's okay, nobody else will see it. No. No deal. If 
flavor shots not made up the recipe well these are flavor shots um, these are um, three bottles of 30 ml which you could uh, make up in a bottle uh, freedom uh, um, Craig Braveheart Dewar okay um, yeah so you could you know they're easy enough to make you just put your PG and VG in a bottle add this stick your neck shots in and away you go so there is 30 ml so it's they're they are about 15 percent mix so you put you take a 100 ml bottle you put half a bottle of flavoring in you put one neck shot in and you add pgvg uh, as necessary it's easy enough to do so any more uh any more for any more and after this um i'll do a giveaway for tickets for expo mm, that's a pretty good one so i will roll this now we have six eligible and have you got any sound effects <laughs> is that one good enough for so there we go. Excellent. You uh, you having a go, Pad? You do a DIY. Yeah, yeah. Go on, go on, enter it. You know you want to. Just wait for Pad Pad to. Don't pull the pad. Get in there. You made an order yesterday, then I'll have something else for a chance. Okay, so let's roll it. Same. And the winner is. Oh, we have Craig Duar. Craig, you have won. I don't know whether I can send it to him yet or whether I have to wait until after the 31st, actually. Mm -hmm. you know see whether we have left so it's congrats on that um so um send me details message me on facebook and i'll sort that out um this week when i post um gammy's the gammy um puff <laughs> no 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 can't piff you're not allowed to piff especially to uh yeah He's, he had his chance. He had his chance. He can't get it. See, um, <laughs> grumpy. Anyway, um, piff the, you want? Do you seriously want to piff? If you want to piff, I, I, you know, I, I'll, I'll piff. You want to piff? Who oh, do you want to piff to? Did you did you say somebody's um, Scots are banned from piffs? Oh, tell you, man, that's, that's just cool. taking the piffs, isn't it? It is. Yeah. Piffing now. Okay, Jerry, you've won before from me, I think. Message me, and uh, I'll sort that out this week. Yeah. Um, probably, actually, I'll, I'll probably sort out Saturday morning because I need to get some more padded bags um, to stick them in. Generous nation of Scotland. I don't know. I haven't met many Scottish people. Although I did know one that he, this one Scottish guy, right? He dropped ten p in the middle of the street, and he got knocked it out, hit him on the back of the neck on the way down. Anyway, this is a bit of a letdown. What do you so, want tonight? Here's the other one, sir. That's the second one tonight. What is it? That was a uh, mango IPA. This one is orange infused pale ale. Oh, so, yeah. where's that one from? Aldi? Um, I can't remember where they're from actually. I've not seen that one before. 
Um, again, this is not too bad. But I'm not getting much flavour from it at all. Um, Scott's always on the piff. No, that's on the piss. Hey, Kevin, good to see you. Kevin, you've just missed out, but we ha uh, let me see, cancel the other way. Uh, okay, so we're on to the next one now, so I right, am no, giving away one. two codes for one day tickets for Expo, whether you can use both yourself, I do not know. Um, so, are you ready? So, if you want to win two codes to Expo tickets, um, I'll email you the codes in the morning or send them on Facebook. Um, uh, There we are. Nice easy keyword. Um, there you go. So if you haven't got tickets for Expo and you want to go, here you go. And if you haven't been to a show before and you fancy going, you know these it's worth a go. Give it a give it a try. Come come to Birmingham for the for the day or the couple of days yeah. and enjoy so I, I get a funny feeling that people probably bought their tickets already um, but we'll find out from chat whether they have or not um, so who's already bought their tickets for Expo Tickets sorted today. Yeah, I got my I got mine sorted, and um, I got ten to give away, so I'm going to give away two today. So, if you were looking for a pair of tickets, get them in. Back in a second. Um, think of a question. He's gone. Wow, he's gone. Ta da! Where did he disappear to? Da -da -da -da. Do you know what? I had two windows up there and I killed them on both.
get out. So nobody wants expo tickets. It's a tough crowd tonight, Chris. It is. It's a very tough crowd. So maybe I'll have to uh, stick on the group then. So let's have a look back. Uh, £25 for Saturday and Sunday together. Um, yeah, didn't you get... Um, you didn't. You didn't get a press. You didn't get a press tickets. Yeah, the VIP thing is a bag and stuff, and I, I don't know whether it's worth it. To be honest, um, I should say yes, yeah, definitely worth it. Oh well, well, nobody wants tickets tonight. I'll just keep them for another night, or stick them on. Uh, maybe I'll do a Facebook stroke somewhere else giveaway. Yeah, so I'm thinking about what oh. to do on th on t on on Thursday. No, tomorrow night is Thursday, isn't it? Maybe after solo, I will do a game show show. So who is up for a game show show tomorrow? One thing I'm up for, Chris, is going to bed. Okie dokie. It's uh, twelve o'clock, school night. It is the school night. I okay, it is I'll, now. I shall catch thee next week. Okay, thank you very much. Adios. And there we go. He's still there. Coolio. And there's. That holster's gone, I could stick some music back on. Although um we see how loud it is now. Let's get some uh, some more jazz on. Jazz Club. Okay, so hopefully that's not too bad. Who's there? Needing his beauty sleep. He's disappeared. Uh, yeah, so who is up for? Um game show show tomorrow oh, who, who in you has played the game show show Tetley Man has played the game show show uh, her scene has I think Craig yeah Craig has, has been on the game show show yeah so, yeah, I'll run one of those tomorrow and um, see how it goes. Um, maybe we can get a massive game running or something. Give it a real good testing out. That would be pretty cool. He was always first away from a sesh when he lived over there. Oh... Uh, A game show show. You need to go back and check on my stream and see what they were. Um, used to run them on Saturday nights just for a, a bit of a play. I'll tell you what. If I can get five people in the room who want to play game show show, I will do a game show show tonight. So, let's see who wants to do a game show show. I'll have to uh, set it all up and get ready for it. Um, I'm pretty sure 
I still have it here. Craig is in. Tetley man. You up for it? Her scene? Not tonight. I'll do it tomorrow, okay. Um, it is early there. So basically, um, yeah, go and check it out, uh, Grump. Um, basically, I run uh, You Don't Know Jack and <laughs> half pints. Basically, I run You Don't Know Jack and run it online so people can answer the questions and it's an interactive thing. That's a uh, good bit of fun. Good Passes a good bit of time. I think we've had like two or three hour shows uh previously because they do they do tend to go on um they do tend to go on and and on and on sometimes you know they're not uh always just the hour that i expect to run but they do go on and and on So let me see where it is. On there. I thought I'd created a, a playlist for the game show show, but obviously not. Um, yeah, there's a couple of game show shows. Um, Go to the go to my go to the channel and look down, and you'll see him. Uh... Yeah, lightweights. So anyway, I'm going to crash out this evening, and I'm going to be checking out a couple of the other channels. Um, I'm going to be looking at uh, iVlog. So if you are uh, hanging out in iVlog, I'll catch you over there. Um, Congrats to the winner this evening. I'll sort that out and uh, get them to you this week. Anyway, adios and catch you next week. <laughs>